Intro Hi everyone, on this episode of In the Spotlight we're looking at the UK Statistics Authority's scolding of the Prime Minister and Immigration Minister for using inaccurate figures to back up spurious claims about asylum seekers. Content The UK Statistics Authority recently scolded the Prime Minister and Immigration Minister after they used inaccurate figures to back up claims about asylum seekers. In December, the Prime Minister claimed that the current asylum backlog was half the size of the backlog left by the Labour government in 2010. However, the UK Statistics Authority found that the asylum backlog in 2010 was 19,000, meaning the backlog had risen almost ninefold to 166,000. The Prime Minister and Immigration Minister had been referring to figures provided by the UK Border Agency, which included duplications, errors, applications moved to a control archive, and applicants who were untraceable, dead, or had become EU citizens via another channel. Shadow Immigration Minister Stephen Kinnock has called on the Prime Minister, Immigration Minister, and Safeguarding Minister to correct the record, as failure to do so could amount to a breach of the ministerial code. The Home Office issued a statement soon after, saying they are taking immediate action to bring down the asylum backlog, having doubled the number of asylum caseworkers, and in the process of rolling out a successful pilot scheme nationwide. Conclusion The UK Statistics Authority taking the Prime Minister and Immigration Minister to task for using inaccurate figures is a microcosm of the immigration issue in the UK as a whole. The Home Office has made efforts to address the backlog, but only time will tell whether or not their efforts are successful. We'll keep you updated on any further developments.